Hello everyone and welcome back to Minecraft Shelby City Construction. And it is episode... It should be 24. 20. I can't believe I've done that. Anyway, I'm not going to tell you what I just figured out yesterday. Because I'm an idiot. Anyway, so, what we are going to be building today is a little shop, a little company, a little whatever called storage support right fall insurance sorry i just i think i just came up with a new medical company hammer to fall insurance Hold on, guys. I'm going to put that in the planning room. You know what? Hold on, guys. I'm going back here. So I, I just wanted to show this off. Yeah. This still doesn't work. There we go. So it's now put in the planning room with everything else. So we got storage support, which we're building now. We got Terry the TNT man. Incorporated, that's for demolishing stuff. We've got horse dealership, which we will be building soon. These two, I'm gonna remove them for now. The Admin City and Sky Prison. We will be building them, and then actual people can actually import stuff from there. But anyway, who's excited to start building? As I know, I am. So this building is gonna be called Storage Support. We wanna kinda make it different from everything else. So I don't want to go up white and black concrete because that seems too overused. I am trying to force myself to, you know, get better at building. Not to say that I'm bad at building, but you know. You know, we can always just build with random blocks now and just change it later. If we feel like it. Fall insurance. That sounds awesome. Because I did just listen to Hammer to Fall, and it was ham. It was in my mind, and it just came to me. You know. Freddie Mercury, especially. And some of you guys might know that I actually have a Freddie Mercury statue by my church. So yeah, that's for all of you hardcore people. And if you are new to this channel, don't forget to leave a subscription. So that's how I say it. I say it weirdly, because if I say it normally, I just feel weird. <coughs> now, what letter just are we going to go for here? Why do I feel like yellow? Right, so that's... Yep, that's how I do my T's. And then we want to do an O. So it's storage. As some of you might know. Now, so... Now that I figured out how to build a pass... I mean, we only have to figure out the door thing, because the door... You don't have a lot of time to get through that door. You have about... Not point two seconds to get through a door, and I'm pretty sure people would majorly appreciate if they had more time to get through a door. So that's something that we'll be trying to figure out after this video. I'm just trying to think. Should I actually? I think I have a different way of doing this. Hold on, let me tear this down. Right, so I just tried doing storage going that way, but then it hit me. Shouldn't I have storage so it's that a little bit easier to see from the street? Right, because if we're looking that away, 
See, I mean, not a lot of people will be looking from this point. They'll all be looking from this point. I mean, like, sure, you can see that, like, working out. But, I don't know. And I'm telling you, these blocks are starting to sit comfortably with me. God damn, that's a catchy tune. Right, so what we want to do, I think, is put storage on this side. Right, and then do... Hold on, let's push this right to the edge. And then do support on that side. Right? <clears throat> so I'm gonna try and get this down. And I'll be right back, because I don't want to take forever doing this. Alright, that's storage. Right there. Oh, and we're gonna have warehouses. Right? And that's gonna be wonderful looking. And then we might have a car dealership around here. Which, in this case, is actually a horse dealership. So now we get support down. Alright. Now we got storage support down, so... Let's have a look at it together for the first time. In total. Yeah. I mean, if Decent Valley wasn't in the way, it'd be fine. But I think that looks really nice. I actually really like the blocks. So, yeah. Oh. Boop. So, this is where people can come and store their stuff. Now, if... I any time I find myself thinking that this should actually be a horse dealership, which the place that they can come and buy horses, and I can always just suddenly change it. But I think it looks nice, actually. I think it does. Because if there's one thing that people always hate is, you know, storage. So I think this is also going to be a place where they could buy shulker boxes. No, this is going to be a place where they could buy shulker boxes. Because one thing that people hate is having a full, messy inventory. Now, I'm still trying to figure out what to do in terms of pickaxes. Because, as some of you guys might know, the quickest and best way to destroy a pickaxe, and I mean a shulker box, is with a pick. Now... If we give them a pick, well, let's just say a diamond pickaxe, they'll be able to break into anything quickly, you know, and they'll have a pick. I don't want to give them a pick, you know, waste of a... Let me show you what's in the actual starter kit. So we got these three books, Law Book of Shelby City, How Money Will Work, and Rules. See, I don't want to put a pickaxe in here. I don't know. If I could, like, program it to only break shulker boxes. If I could, even. Anyway, so, we're going to bring this black around, like this. Black will really, really build up. Yep. And then we just so these two sides I think are gonna be glass but we need to bring some more hardened stuffs around yeah, hardened terracotta doesn't say it but I know it is so we're actually gonna have this weird kind of glass thing going on I don't know why, but I think it will make the building look just that little bit more interesting. So let's do it over here. Okay, I know we got that glass um, thing around. don't really know what to call it. So yeah, it does look very nice. And obviously we get the black going above the letters. Let me do that. Right, so that's the black around like that. Looks very nice, looks very nice. Actually, it does look very nice. So, what we're then going to do is we are going to... I want to say box off the store. But if we box off the store, it would probably look really boring. 
So I think we're gonna go in until that middle point. And then we're gonna go in. That lamppost? Yeah, that lamppost. And then we're gonna go back. So, you know, just have somewhat of an, of an interesting shape. Or otherwise, party of a poop will me. I don't want to be killed. I don't know, see, we can just. Now, these back bits, I don't think will actually be windows. I mean, we might put a few windows in. Because heck, you know, windows. So, I mean, just get this um, barrier layout thing built up. All right. So I got, so I got the um, what? I'm really bad at speaking today, aren't I? Jeez. Okay, so I got the walls down. That's the main point I want to get down. So we can connect this up. I mean the wall layout, so I don't have the actual walls in, but I will be getting them in later. And I think this will look ever so slightly like transport support with the words actually being not the same height as the actual rest of the building. But I think that will work pleasantly. So now the only thing I have to do, which I'm going to cut away and do, Oh, and here's the subway. Oh, sh... And there's the subway. So, I had a lot of problems with that, by the way. Jeez. I mean, I have to dig down far. I thought I went far enough. But apparently, I only went one block. I should have gone deeper. So, yeah. All I have to do is put... They're caught underneath the windows, so it doesn't look weird. I'm gonna make it probably blue glass or some other glass if I do decide. And I'm gonna put the walls around and I will be right back. Right? Because you come into the city, right, with all of this crap in your inventory, probably because everybody manages to get crap out in their inventory because they play Minecraft, you know, Minecraft. Right? And they need to put it somewhere, you know? It's like, what do I do with all of this? Yeah. Anyway, back to building. Hello, everyone. I am back. <laughs> I have built up all the walls and all the glass. It is looking wonderful. Looking schmiffy. Now, I did decide to add more doors over there. And some more doors. Like, as you know, a store needs more than two doors. Because, you know... Who can ever have enough doors? I really think this is cramped. Can we change this at all? I can see why we built storage support back a bit. So what I think we're going to do is I think we're just going to move the door back. We're not going to move the whole store. No, we're just going to move the doors. <coughs> so yeah, I got the doors. I got all the glass, I got everything down. And that actually looks that actually looks nicer. So now it is time for the floor. I'll do the other door later. But what floor shall we go with? Now, some would say, let's be funny and make the whole floor chess. No. Now we could just be simple and go for oak. Cover oak and dark oak stripped logs. See how that works. We'll just do a little segment over here. Yeah, that actually looks really nice. Definitely. Now, do we want the wood going that way or do we want to go that way? Right, I think we'll have the wood. going this way like this I don't know why I just think it would look better right so I'm gonna get these logs now 
and then we'll be back to do the interior. Hopefully. Hee <laughs> hee. Hello everyone and welcome back. I have built the floor. The floor has been dug, it has been placed, and it is looking smithy. And also I got this Egypt in my game now. I'm just kidding. And now it is time to put on the roof. The ceiling. The ceiling and the roof. So, I was thinking, what do we want for yellow? Just out there, you know, because the chest is yellow. And so the ceiling should be yellow. Yeah. Yeah. And then, of course, on top of that, then we can do... And it's like, just straight on top. Um, so we'll have to do some... A little bit weird like this, because I don't really like the side of andesite. Like, I like andesite, I just don't like the side. What about some strange like this? I think that will actually look... ...fine. But instead of doing that, we just have it rip around. Whip around. So yeah, as per usual, I am going to... ...snip, snip, snip... ...away. I'm gonna get all of this down. I might move this to the corner. It just might look better. I'm gonna snip, snip, snip away. I think I'm also gonna put in a strange different color here. Like a blue or a white or something. Or I might just go with yellow. Yellow sure. Anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna snip snip away and I'm gonna do the ceiling, the roof, and then I'll be back to do the interior. Guys, so I am back. I have put down all the roofing. It is looking wonderful. I put down the ceiling, which is yellow. Looks actually quite nice. And the building from above looks like this. Actually looks very nice. Very, very nice. Oof. I mean, how good does that look? Poop. TP to me and look at how good that looks from here. It just looks so good. Look at, it. look at that quality built. Storage support. Oh, I like it. Oh, that's why this city makes me giggle. Like a little girl. Wait. Okay. Thought that S was a G there for a second. So now, the only thing we have to figure out is the inside. So now we could just throw chests everywhere, but that ain't gonna help, you know. Now I do know in the furniture store you can actually buy cabinets, but I think this is more storage supporty. So I think what we'll have is we'll have a place so you can actually view all the stock, right? So we're gonna. I think we're going to break up a part of this floor. And what we're going to do is we're going to put glass on that. On this white concrete. We're going to put... Should I do yellow again? Oh, and also when we build a horse dealership thing, that's going to be sponsored by transport support. So that's going to be really interesting. Yeah, so... I'm going to do something like this. This glass will go all the way up. Um, actually, I think... I think we'll replace this. There we go. I think that just looks a lot nicer. But what we'll do is we'll bring this around. This kind of does resemble a storage... Oh, sorry, a car dealership. More. But I think I'm liking it. I think I'm liking it. Now what we could do is put the word store. Oh, let me try that. Um, how does that look? That looks alright. But I think having the word store inside the store is kind of dumb. We'll be back in 15 minutes. What we could do is we can just 
Right, so if I haven't cut back yet, then I'm back. Um, so I decided to put the word store right here, right? Implementing that new store things. And then I decided to just sprinkle a little bit of sugar boxes. So now what we are going to do is we're going to put glass around all of this. Alright guys, so I am back and I have done this. I have built up the glass and it looks quite interesting. Although I am kind of thinking if we should uh, do something a little bit different. But you know, it is good. It is good painter. It is good. Okay, so what we do is... <coughs> Now, this place will only be selling sugar boxes. Right? And I think we'll have a cubicle. Very fancy word. We'll have a cubicle right here. Right there. Right? Maybe we should have it in the middle of the store. That seems wild. We're gonna put this. I uh, do I sound bored? I feel like I sound bored. Oh, okay, right. So what we are gonna do is we are gonna build this kind of kind of kind of kind of thing right here, right. And then what we're gonna do? Thought I messed up there for a second. What we gonna do is we gonna put some quartz, some slab quartz right here and when we do that people can't get into the cubicle the cubicle that will have more than likely a zero meaning because nobody is allowed to work here or in transport support they have to, yeah, i mean i mean i i will employ them if they want but they'd have to come to me for more support you know it's called citizen support Although that won't work because it doesn't have anything to do with support. Although, I think everything has to do with you. And then what we're going to do, right, is we're going to put some sling lanterns right here. So it looks very, very interesting. Right? And then what we're going to do is we're going to build around these end rods. So that also looks very interesting. And then we're going to build around them again. So that it looks even more interesting. And there we go. We got an interesting centerpiece. To buy shulker boxes. Because you know you need the shulker boxes. Because shulker boxes are very very interesting. And now we just put a few signs. Right, let's just say guys. Right. If I, if I do decide to come back. No, I'm not going to have it going down that low. But, you know, just having it that low for this example, right? And then what we can do is have it so it pops right up underneath this block. Not anywhere else, just right there. So let's say they put in the item. Right now, obviously, we'll have to build what I like to call a Pacific fire. Right, so then only Pacific blocks and or items may pass through here. You know. Oh, so we're gonna take this block. We're not gonna give one damn on how it's placed or how it looks. Right, and so boom. Now, so the dispenser is right over here. Now, so we will have to do two dispensers. I have to do something like that, right? So what we do then is we get it, get this hooper, hooper, 
like a bit of wood or something. We get this hooper. Come right over there. We'll actually need mercurines. You see, this is the tricky part. This is the tricky part. You know what? We could just leave it like that. And then 19. And then so they all go to this dispenser. Now, you would think, and just, you know, have a comparator, and something like this. But it's actually not that simple. Right? Okay, now let's say. Let's say we want to make them um, pay a whole stack. You know what? Hold on. Yeah, you know what? Whole stack. A whole stack for things because I believe. Oh. So the actual total is 45. Yeah, 45 crystals. So I think we'll make it cost that much. Maybe? Yeah, yeah, I think we will. And if they put not enough in there then they lose their money oh well hee <laughs> oh that needs to be the bottom one now the only question is how do we get that to tick 45 times wait a minute why do we want them to pay and then get their money back that's pointing in there now should we sell purple ones and then just sell dye as a separate thing I think that would be smart one. and now okay so I'm just cutting back here just in case I haven't so what I have done here is I have conducted a machine right that when you put your Pacific item in 45 items must make sure the dispenser is always empty oh, crap. we need a way for it to get emptied all right let's where's my money well let's just say all right this is already full of 45 This is already full of 45. This will never work again. Unless we can get it to empty. Completely and entirely. Hey guys, hello, I'm back. Now, I think I got it to work. I think. So if we were to put those in there. All right, now we do have to wait just a few seconds. It's not gonna pop out immediately. I'm not a freaking wizard. But I think I got it to work. Now I did get it to a point where it shoots out two shulker boxes. Hello everyone. Yeah, you know what? Hello everyone, we can make to Minecraft. With me. Um, oh, sorry. I cut, I'm cutting back, aren't I? Hee <laughs> hee. Right, guys. So, welcome back. I have built storage support. And just, I'm going to recap everything that we've done in this episode. And hopefully this does just get recorded. But everything that we've done in this wonderful episode is we've built this structure. And this is a structure that will 
um, help people for getting storage boxes, shulk boxes. And we got this lovely floor, this lovely ceiling, this lovely everything else. You put 45 crystals into here, and mercury, sorry, and then it pops out two shulker boxes, like it says on these two signs. We have store here, because, you know, gotta remind them they're in a store, to store. And then we have complimentary dice, and that's it! So, I want to thank you all very much for watching this extra long video, because I was just in my editing, and it turns out it's 29 minutes. We're like 30 now, at this stage. But anyway guys, thanks for watching, and also here's what it looks like at night. Thanks for watching, don't forget to leave a like if you feel like you've actually enjoyed it, or at least not hated it. And if you feel like you're gonna not... If you, love it, if you feel like you're gonna like my content, or at least not hate it, then don't forget to feel free to subscribe. And guys, I will catch you all in the next Shelby City construction video. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye!